Magnets like these are great fun to play with. Cameron, Amelia, what do you notice about magnets? They stick together, they stick to metal, they can pick it up. Great answers, yeah. guys. Yeah. And that's right. A magnet can pull things to it. It's called attraction. But how do they do that, Kira? Well, because every magnet is surrounded by something called a magnetic field that attracts certain things to it. A magnetic field? Oh, that sounds exciting. I'd really like to see one. Well, Zoom, a magnetic field is invisible. Oh. But there is a way that we can see it. Oh, how? Good question. So, here I put a magnet under this plastic sheet. Yeah. This container is filled with tiny little bits of metal called iron filings. Oh, is that why we're wearing safety goggles? Exactly. We mm -hmm. have to be very careful with these, okay? Kay. So, I'm going to start pouring them onto the plastic, okay? Now, I'm going to watch very closely. <gasps> the wow! Super sharp. <gasps> oh, oh, what's happening, Kira? Well, the magnet is attracting the iron filings and arranging them in the shape of its magnetic field. So now we can see it. Ah. Can you see it, guys? What do you think? It looks cool. This is the magnetic field, see? Oh, cool. Oh. Akira, mm -hmm. can a magnet attract anything? No, Zoom. Magnets only attract certain kinds of metal. Mm. Like these filings, they're made of a metal called iron. And iron is very attracted to magnets. Let me show you something else. Oh, cool. Ooh. Yeah. What is this? <laughs> this is a bumblebee and it's made of paper clips. Oh. And the paper clips have iron in them. I've attached a magnet to the top of this metal frame. And the bee is attached to this thread. Okay. Cameron, do you want to give it a go? Yes, please. Oh, let's see. Now. Oh! oh. Wow. Wow. That's, that's so cool. Yeah, it's floating in midair. Hey, I want to try. Go for it. Yeah. Now don't let go. Okay. Don't let go. Let's go straight. Keep holding it and now you can move your hand. Oh. <gasps> yeah. Wow, it's like magic. <laughs> <laughs> so the magnet is attracting the paper clips and the thread is holding it back. Oh, wow. Oh, I just love magnets. <laughs> We know that magnets attract metal things, but what happens when you put two magnets together? Any ideas, guys? Um, they just stick together like... Oh, let's have a look. So, I've put these magnets on these poles. Now, I'm going to put these magnets on top. Uh, will I try it? Yes. Yeah. Go. Okay, careful, Mike. It's heavy. Will I let it drop? drop it. Yeah, drop it. Will yeah. I do some more? Let's yes. make a cake. Okay, yeah. let's do more. Two layer cake. It's we know floating. what's going to happen this time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a spring. It's like a spring. Yeah. yeah. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. I think we should do some more. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and one more. Basketball. Oh, oh, that's so basketball. Cool. Oh. Can I try? Yeah, go for it. Amelia, you can take this one. Cameron, you take this side, and I'll take this side. Uh, 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 it's uh, 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 it's all bouncy, isn't it? So, Mike, what's going on here? Well, Zoom, when you bring two magnets together, mm -hmm. they can attract each other like this, or they can push each other apart like this. Oh. So, yeah. this one is, like, pushing it away from it. Yeah, because it all depends on which way they're facing. And these magnets are quite strong. So when we turn them this way, they're pushing each other apart a lot. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you want to help me take them off? Oh, it's so messy. Magnets are really handy, but sometimes the pulling yeah. power can be a bit wow. tricky to manage. I just saved the magnet. Good job. <laughs> Mark, wouldn't it be great if you could just switch your magnet on and off when you need it to? Mm. Believe it or not, Zoom, you can. Huh? I can show you by making my own magnet. OK, Cameron, can you confirm for me that this is not a magnet? Try picking up some paper clips with it. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's definitely not a magnet. Yeah. Definitely nope. not a yeah. magnet. Mm -mm. Now, I've wrapped copper wire around the metal part, and now I'm going to attach both ends to a battery. Whoa. Will we test it? Yes. Okay. So it's going to work now. Wow. do it. Stop, okay. stop. Amelia, I want you to test this for me. Okay. Now, let's see what happens this time. So try to pick up some paper clips with it. Yeah, and you can use this end to pick up these paper clips. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, it's turned into a magnet. That's right. When you wrap copper wire around something metal and then run electricity through it, it becomes a magnet. It's actually called an electromagnet. What do you think would happen if I took the battery off? It would, it would, it would just drop everything. Let's test it. Hmm. Go. I don't know. Oh, oh, there you go. That's amazing. Mm.